Kay and Ant have waited so long and patiently for this day, and I know we're all so excited to finally be here together and help them celebrate. One story I do have to tell, though, is about how Kay and Ant met. You may know they were set up on a blind date. This was years ago, but I remember the weeks leading up to this date very clearly. Every redhead guy that we passed driving or walking was now Anthony. <laughs> we even sat at a restaurant one morning getting breakfast before the date, and what do you know, a redhead guy was sitting right behind us. And I don't think Kay said more than two words to me other than, oh my God, Matt, do you think that's Anthony? And I'm like, Kay, just eat your breakfast. <laughs> And once they finally met, I think we both wondered, how do we ever think there was another redhead as special as Anthony? To so just keep doing whatever you're doing. She is the best version of herself with you. It already feels like you two have been married for years, but I guess that's how it must feel when you find your soulmate. Kay, <laughs> it's been such an honor to stand beside you on your big day and watch you marry your best friend and love of your life. May they live a very happy and long life together filled with laughter and so much love. Congrats, you two. We all love you so much. Saw you walking by today Let the sun set in Friends, we've been invited here today as a supportive community under God to share with Kayla and Anthony in a very important moment in their lives as they are joined together in marriage. Since meeting one another over six years ago, it has been made clear through their devotion to one another that they not only complete each other, but more importantly, that their love and understanding of one another is both strong and sincere. I felt love for a little while. Kayla Rose. So just to let you know, I put on Joy of My Life when I was writing these as some background music to make sure I got the feeling of these words right. So now just how to put this song that has been what the coming together of our lives has proven to be into words, that I'm not sure I can do, but this is the attempt. You are the joy of my life, and I vow to honor and cherish that joy as the gift that it has proved to be. Purity and innocence of your smile has cultivated a love in me that I didn't know could ever be true. As your husband, I vow to love you for who you are and for who you've yet to become. So cover me up and know you're enough. It's using for good. Over six years ago, Allie mentioned to me that she has this really nice guy she works with and would love to set me up. Six years later, here we are in front of friends and family getting married. Blind dates aren't so bad after all. And not to mention my entire family fell in love with you right away. I can't wait to spend the rest of my life with you 
We will go through the good and the bad, just like any marriage does, but I promise to always stand by your side. I will continue to be your biggest motivator, supporter, and loving wife. I am looking forward to seeing what life has in store for us and one day raising a beautiful family together. May the placement of these rings and the declaration of your vows to one another symbolize your dedication and undying love. Since confirming your relationship and dedication to one another, you have been there for one another as, as partners, companions, helpmates, and friends. Now that you have confirmed your love and your dedication to one another before the supportive community, I implore you to cling tenderly yet tightly to one another as you continue your journey now as one. Hey Lynn Anthony, love is patient, love is kind, love does not envy, it does not boast, it is not proud. Love is not rude, it is not self-seeking, it is not easily angered, and it keeps no record of wrongs. Having declared yourself, your love, and your devotion to one another before this community, I am now honored to pronounce you husband and wife. Kayla and Anthony, please seal your marriage with a kiss. <laughs> oh, Just want to say it's a huge honor to be standing up here as your best man on one of your biggest days of your life. Couldn't be any better. It's been such a successful and amazing day. I would love to give credit where credit is due, obviously to Dawn and JR and my parents, Lisa and Anthony, and obviously Anthony and Kayla for inviting us all here today, having us here on their special day. It means a lot. And man, congratulations to, to the bottom of my heart. I'm so happy for you, dude, it's insane. I've seen you go through every chapter of your life and I can honestly say that you are easily at your best and only getting better with Kayla by your side going through every step of your way. Kayla, I know today is officially your wedding day, but it always feels like you've been family since day one. You've been able to put up with Anthony's hectic day-to-day -day schedule and do things like go to heavy metal concerts when you and him both know that is the last place on earth that you would ever want to be at. And also do things like sit on the beach and watch him surf for hours and never know where he's at out there. You can never find him. That day that you guys got engaged on the beach in Costa Rica was a beach day that you two and I will both remember for the rest of our lives. Woo! Woo! For you two, the, the future is endless. I know everything is coming to you however you want it. The world's right in front of you. And it's, it's awesome. I'm so excited for you. Would like to make a cheers and a toast. Raise your glasses for them. Because this is one and done for them and to the rest of their lives. Cheers. Love you. Woo!